Chappelle, I'm CEO and founder of TradeSpoon, and today I'd like to go over current market conditions and trade of the day. For those of you who are new, welcome. Very important to read the disclosures. If you're new to trading stock and options, please visit optionscreen.com to understand the risk associated with trading stock and options. And you can always pause the screen if you need more time to read the disclosures. All right, let's take a look. We just had a CPI data. This is mixed. Spiders closed pretty much flat. Overhead resistance 412, support 406. Models see a downtrend. So our neural network, based on the current price action and momentum, sees that potentially we can revisit 400 level, which is the key support where the 50-day moving average, 200-day moving average, and last year downtrend <clears throat> meets. For six months, similar picture, it's neutral. Basically saying at 412, market is overbought. Potentially pulling to 365. I don't think we, I mean, unless there's some kind of a negative news in the market, which I'm not sure where it would be come from. I don't think we're going to drop below this downward trend line. So a lot of support, you know, 200 day moving average, 50 day moving average downtrend line. So I favor pull back to 400 and then March, April from seasonality point of view, usually very strong months. Then we retest 420 and best case scenario will retest the August high around 430. So I think we have 20 points to the upside, maybe 20 points to the downside and market is going to trade in the range going into next earning cycle which is in april we do have retail numbers tomorrow we have a ppi data we have leading indicators on friday which can all spark short-term volatility and the pullback to the 400 level personally i'm still selling out of the money premium whether it's a credit put spread on divan energy if there's earnings momentum or buying stocks so noc so i'm trading around the stock position close today it reached the over first overhead resistance second overhead resistance is closing the gap at 483 I'm still bullish on noc that's all i have for today of course scenario again and keep an eye on interest rates right we do have a pretty strong rally in interest rates closed session high to your yield at 52 week high dollar is also remains resilient and i think that's a headwind for the market short term thank you very much and have a great day